here's one of those little experiments you can do on your own and it's it's not going to work every time and it's probably not going to work m much of the time but it, it it probably will work some of the time so that's a fancy way of saying if you keep trying it eventually it'll probably work for you and it has to do with having street lights turn off uh, as you're driving past them you could also do it walking but driving uh, you don't have to be the driver you can be a passenger but you're in a car and you're going Pass a lot of street lights. That's a good opportunity to do it because in a car you can go past a lot of street lights. Walking takes a little while. So as you're in a car passing street lights, uh, uh, try to have try to um, have the street light turn off as you're approaching, either approaching right under or after. Basically, when you're an eye shot of the street light, it'll turn off. And if you have this in your mind enough of the time, you'll notice that you it'll start to happen with regularity. Um, I was for a while. I was noticing it probably between two and three streetlights would turn off on me a, 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 every day, every night, like literally, like two or three a night. Sometimes it would be none. Sometimes it would be four or five. Sometimes it would be one or two. But it was something that would happen on a routine basis. So anyway, there are also ways to uh, say, well, that's just the streetlights on a timer. Uh huh. Yeah, some of them are on a timer. But what about the streetlights in your own hometown that aren't on a timer, that are on all night? They don't they don't turn off and on. They're just always on. But then several of them shut off on you in the same evening as you're driving past them. It's, just an, it's an easy one to, to play with. So let me know if it works. And um, yeah.